right, as you can just see from that absolute idiot of a van driver, he actually looked at me and what a stupid place to overtake. But he looked at me and then continued to overtake rather than break and pull back in. Uh, but you can be as aware and alert as you like, but you can't do anything about what other drivers do on the road. Uh, thankfully, it wasn't that great a deal because we're plenty of time uh, for me to react and pull over more to the left and also time to throw my fist up in the air and have a few choice words in my head, I think. Some of them might have come out loud. Uh, but yeah, a tip, just make sure your road positioning is right and you're paying attention to everything. Uh, remember, you only get one chance at it. You don't get to analyse over the footage and determine what's the best route of action. You only have a split second to make your decision. Uh, be it the right one or the wrong one, you still only have a split second. Uh, so yeah, it's all to do with your positioning and your awareness. So another good reason why any of you who are interested in progressing your motorcycle and riding skills to contact and join any of your local advanced riding schools you've got IAMS and ROSPA a lot of your local police um, do bike safe days uh, it's better than nothing it's, you'll certainly learn, learn a lot uh, but you can't be going and joining your local advanced riding school says me who's not been a member of the past year so I really need to go and book myself in as well and get some more advanced training done get assessed and continue my learning <laughs>